Here is a small little spreadsheet I've got in Excel, but it's just to demonstrate something, which is something called AutoSum, which you may have used before. What AutoSum does is it automatically will calculate a total of some figures, say in this column here, or possibly in a row there. It's this button here, which is the auto sum. If I click on it, it will automatically highlight the column here. It's automatically detected that there are some numbers above it, and then it's actually going to um, choose those. And you'll see here it's done the little formula for me down here, so I don't need to know what it is. If I press Enter, it will now give me that total there. And you will probably know that if I change that number, it will automatically update the total here. It works for rows as well, but just so that we can see what would happen if I deleted that one. I'm just going to click here. Same sort of thing would have applied with the column as well. I'm going to click, and you'll see it hasn't highlighted everything there. All I have to do is click and drag to highlight it. You'll see it's automatically entered in the range here. It doesn't have to be just a row. I could highlight this whole block here, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to highlight that. And again, when I press Enter, it's done that total for me. Now, I could easily just copy and paste that. You may have done that before, and it will just copy the formula across. But if you've seen my tutorial on autofill, you'll know that there is another little function, and you can copy with autofill too. You can copy your formulas. So if I move to the bottom right-hand corner of that cell and click and drag across, it automatically puts the formula in. You can see that they're different at the top there. I can do the same for the rows here as well. So there you go, that's AutoSum, and I've used AutoFill to automatically copy those for me. However, there are some little quick tricks with the AutoSum. I'm just going to delete those. If I highlight that block that I want to total up, I can also include the row where I want the total to appear. And if I click on my AutoSum button, it's going to automatically drop those in there for me, and I can do the same for the rows as well. And there you are, it's automatically done those. I could now total all of these up, and press Enter, and I've now got a grand total down the bottom here too. There is one little thing that can make this a little bit quicker. If I highlight all of these, include the row and the column where I want the answer to appear, plus where the grand total is going to appear. If I now click on Auto Sum, it will fill in the whole lot. That's Auto Sum and using a little bit of autofill.